Friday, April 1st. The sun and the moon are in Aries. It's a dark sky. It's time to go inside. To go very introverted. And to reflect. To reflect on ourselves. How we're presenting ourselves into the world. How are we initiating new things? Are we taking action or are we just waiting for things to happen? Are we just waiting around for somebody else to do something? Or are we initiating that thing? What do you want to do? What do you want to start in your life? This could be a new diet new exercise program. You may be a writer, writing a novel of some kind, or a self-help book. Maybe you want to be a comedian or an actor. Maybe you want to be an entrepreneur, starting off a new business. Whatever it is, now is the time to plant the new seed of what it is that you want and or need in your life. Now, I want to talk about courage and bravery. These two themes are really important when discussing Sun and Aries, Moon and Aries. Very fearless individuals. Aries is all about going for the gold and just taking the chance, taking that risk. Susan Boyle, whose birthday is today, took a risk and a chance when she presented herself to all those people in that auditorium on Britain's Got Talent, where it just proves that you can't judge somebody by the way that they look or how old they are or whatever other reason. Give them a chance. Give them the opportunity to show you what they have. When everybody listened to I Dream to Dream, they were amazed. It was a wow in everybody's mind, on everybody's face, of how beautiful, how spectacular, how strong and passionate her voice was. And that's another thing about Aries. They're incredibly passionate. It's all about the fire energy of passion. And that was the risk that she decided to take. That was the chance. That was the thing that she decided to do. Doesn't have to be as big as that. But what do you want to do? What do you want to do that's different? What are you afraid of? That you need to get yourself together and be brave and just go for it. Just just do it. Just act upon something. Even though this new moon is quiet, you really act upon what it is that we want. So, it's new moon, Mercury is also involved with it, so we can communicate, this allows us to think, to plan, to strategize in our minds. How are we going to do this? And what do we want? What do we need? And we can talk about it. Because Mercury is also communication. 
So thank you for tuning in. Happy New Moon. And bye for now.